What's going on, y'all? Welcome back. Here are the mods I was talking about last video. We've got the VMS 15 by 8 so this should clear all the Gen 3 suspension without having to buy the aftermarket knuckles. They're meant for Hondas and, and uh, Fords. That's why there's 10 lugs. Uh, 14 pounds, 15 by 8 and then the bare brakes are next door. Uh, not that special, but what we're doing is we're going to test fit it on his car. God, oh little ass wheels um on his car because it should give us a good estimate that way i know hey i need to go ahead and send it back or um you know keep moving forward so his car you can fit 15s with no modification uh just a sweet part relocation it's 40 bucks for a whole 40 dollars yeah. <laughs> they can throw 15s on this shit and he does have a tiny not tiny i'll check this out i'll say those are the those are ass breaks this this is the good shit right here but we're gonna throw this on and see how it works so VMS said, hey, you can test fit them. Don't bolt them down, but you can test fit them. Just don't scratch it. So they recommended that we tape off the, you know, the impact areas, essentially. Uh, so that's what we did. And Ty is going to throw it on. So it looks like it clears all the suspension on his car. You know what? So it clears pretty much everything except for his caliper which is the one thing that I think is smaller on the bears. However, the offset ooh, is good. Uh, it's at an angle because it's, it's, we don't want it to rest on the caliper. Uh, but the offset looks good. It looks like it's kind of far out right now, but that's because we have about a quarter of an inch on this side and a half of an inch on this side that it can be pushed in more. So I think we're good. Uh, obviously, the final test is going to be putting the bears on the third gen and seeing, but... Uh, we'll have that thrown on hopefully tomorrow, and we'll have an update. All right, guys. A few days later, we're at Murillo Motorsports, Motorsports now. Uh, his car. We're doing a couple little sweet things to it real quick, and then we're going to throw the brakes on that guy. Now, I feel a little stickiness going on in there. Don't worry about it. I'm trying to get your nose. get that nose. This oh. is going to be great content for the YouTube channel. <laughs> You throwing breathers on here? You got breathers? I like to play with throttle bodies. Let's just get it off and pull up. Are you bolting? Like yeah, so this thing is doing. So we gotta. I gotta cut this thing. <laughs> oh. Who's that one? Can't wait for me. Man, I ain't trying to go alone. Mm -hmm. Get the fuck up! Alright, so. Mike's car is done. The full CJ setup. It's dumped now. Is all done. Um, he's got to upload his new tune for it, throw some E in it. And while we're doing that, we're going to throw the rears on the gray car. And this guy's having nothing but fun with that 15. It's heavy, huh? Look, he's struggling. It's real, real heavy. Yeah.
All right, so we got the whole squad here. Pick this bitch up. You capping this night on me though. Holy shit! I can manhandle this thing. That's shocking for someone your size. Yeah, that's, that's, that's saying quite a bit. Give it to Marilla. God damn, bro. Hey, hey. Don't hate on VMS. They're made in somewhere in America. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right, all right. So we've got a scale. We've got a stock base model Gen Three tire. It's an 18 by like eight and a half or some shit. And then we're going to weigh the who's here. All right, so I'll throw that hole on. All right, I'm guessing it's going to be about see. 53 pounds. God motherfucking damn. Okay, now this really looks like I planned that. 5. 52 and a half pounds for the stock. Uh, this is a front or rear tire for the Gen 3s. And now we're going to throw the 15 by four and a half on there. How much are you guessing about? 22.5. 22.5? <laughs> Maybe. Nah, I'm thinking like 24. Like 24. 20. Oh. Holy shit. Oh. Yeah, I almost got it. I almost got it. Okay, so what's that? Well, it was, it was 52.5? Yeah, 52.5. Oh, okay, yeah. easy. That's 30 pounds. So times that by two. Like yeah, 60. so 60 pounds just in the front, and the brakes dropped 50 pounds, so 110 pounds in rotational mass in two mods. People do your weight reduction. Yeah, weight reduction matters, especially on a naturally aspirated car. For funsies, we're taking Tyus's uh, st damn stock rear GT500 wheel. I think it's an 18 by 10. It's got a 285 on it. Um, it's very worn, so I don't know. You know, that's gonna make a difference. But a little bit less tread. You know. All right, it's still on. We're good. Uh, I'm gonna go with 60 plus. I think so. Easy. Uh, yeah, it looks like you're struggling. I'm just a little weak. You know. Wow. About the same? That's actually a lot of 53. That's not too bad. That's, that's crazy as shit, actually. dude. All right, guys. Gen 3 stock wheels are obviously garbage. Um, yeah. That's wow. crazy. I thought those would be shit. way SPT for the win. Yeah. All right. So the stock rear setup weighs in at 30 pounds. The Bears weigh in at 15. So that's another 30 pounds rotational mass off the car. Yeah, too good. Uh, ain't no TBM. TBM. <laughs> ain't no motherfucking aerospace. Damn. What kind of brakes you got? <laughs> it's crazy. Uh, TBM so good they stopped the car from working. Mm. <laughs> All right, guys. So everything is on and buttoned up. Unfortunately, the 15s did not fit. So I'm going to have to just get some 17 by 10s like everybody else. But. They look great. We're going to get some shots of them tomorrow when there's some sunlight and the car is clean. And uh, that'll be the outro. All right, guys. Here in the garage, finally found some Poverty Star rears. <laughs> it is what it is. <clears throat> finally got some 17 by 9.5 Poverty Stars here. Uh, it does show the red caliper quite nice. But this is the finished product. Um, be prepared, guys. For the amount of brake dust that these are going to produce um <clears throat> those were already dirty but check this out these have maybe a hundred miles on them you can see all the bits of debris and brake material everywhere <clears throat> the calibers get dirty as fast as hell too that's off the caliber right there which really sucks because the fire truck or the uh, fire red looks really good. But that's it for today, guys. I got some runs coming up soon here. Um, have those posted up and any new adventures on this or Tyus's car, you guys will be sure to see.